Today, we're going to install the battery portion of Nextracker's NX Fusion Plus Solar and Storage Solution. NX Fusion Plus is an integrated solar and storage solution consisting of Nextracker's leading single axis tracker, NX Horizon, an Avalon vanadium flow battery, and a DC coupled ideal power three port string inverter. This is a simple product to install, requiring little more work than installing a typical string inverter. Compared to a central storage system, the installation time and materials required are reduced dramatically. The first step is to install the piles that the battery will be placed upon. The piles are galvanized steel. These piles are driven at the same time as the tracker array piles. The battery will require four piles at the end of each tracker row. The next step is to install the cross rails to the piles. The cross rails are bolted to the piles using mating plates and blind fasteners known as huck bolts. Please note that the mating plate bolt holes are slotted. This permits easy leveling of the battery mounting rails. Now we're ready to install the battery. So you are aware, the battery is shipped wet. The battery is pre-commissioned, integrated with the attached inverter. All battery to inverter wiring is complete for ease of installation and use. Key to the next tracker NX Fusion Plus storage system is that the assembly is installed as a single unit placed upon the completed mounting platform with a forklift, then bolted into place. The only remaining steps are to connect the DC and AC wiring to the inverter. The AC wiring is terminated inside the inverter. The DC wiring is terminated at the bottom of the inverter with standard MC connectors. The inverter is capable of accepting up to six strings for a total of 12 DC wires. Our inverter output is typical 480 volt delta AC, so we will be terminating four wires inside the inverter. The battery is now ready to be placed into service. Once the entire PV system has been commissioned and the monitoring equipment has been linked up, all that remains to be done is for the AC and DC disconnects to be closed in order to energize the entire system. There are three key benefits to installing the vanadium flow battery into our system. The first is that the huck bolts can be installed far more quickly than regular nuts and bolts. They will be installed with the same hydraulic tools used to install the tracker array. The second benefit is that the installation is permanent. These fasteners are swaged and do not require retightening. The third benefit is that we use the same fasteners as we use to assemble the tracker, thus simplifying the bill of materials and reducing cost. 